My name is Wesley Snipes, and I'm live with Power Player Magazine. Ladies and gentlemen, the most exciting stage show you ever went to is appearing live. Eddie, thank you so much for giving us your time. What I'd like to find out is you're getting an award tonight. Tell us about the award that you're receiving. Well, I, I don't know whether it's for a hero or being a legend. <laughs> I know if I'm a legend, then that means I'm getting it because I live long enough to be around. <laughs> so I, you know, I don't know which one it is. It's either I don't know what kind of hero I am, you know, but I know I am a legend. That's old. <laughs> <laughs> well, you look nice tonight. So my next question is, who are some of the power players, meaning people who were who made a positive impact in your life that have brought you to where you are today? You see that gentleman over there? Let me go up and get that. Stop the dark skinned gentleman. Let's see if we can get him. Let's see if we get him. Yes. That, that Let's zoom in on him. His name is H.B. Bonner. H.B. Bonner. He's, All he's right. probably one of the reasons why <laughs> I'm around. Okay. He, he's probably he's the guy who taught me how to really sing and use my talent. Uh, he brought me out here about uh, what it had to be at least 50 years ago. Really. Stayed with him. I come out to stay for 14 days. Mm -hmm. End up staying forever. It's Leela. We're live here with the Power Player magazine, and we have a power player right in my miss, and this is the fabulous George Roof, Clinton. Roof. <laughs> I've been deeply detected. Right. I got my rabies shot. We kind of took him away from, and I'm from ready all to the bury excitement. The bone. <laughs> so tell us, what brings you here tonight? We're just so excited to see you. Well, they got the 50th anniversary of Motown, <laughs> the, 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 um, the, what is it, the Hall Hall Awards, Hall Hall Awards, Hall Hall Awards Hall and. Um, it's a party. I'm at all parties. All right. And I'm getting honored tonight okay. uh, on um, 50 Years of Funkin' Around. 50 Years of Funkin' Around. Just getting started. So I'm going to ask you something. <laughs> the magazine that we have is called The Power Player. And I'd like to find out who are the two people that were most influential in your life that made an impact who are power players that were not related to you. Wow. Yeah, I wanted to go deep. Well, you know, <laughs> it, it would, I would have to say... There's people that have to be Motown as a company, for one. Town, all right. As a company, I mean, that would be one. And, um, wow, I, I spread the other ones. You're going to spread them around? That would have to be, you know, Sly Stone. So, let me ask you this. Um, Beatles. Uh, the Beatles, all right, yeah, all right. I mean, Inspiration. Yeah, yeah. Where'd you Fire bring play? the funk from? <laughs> all of that. The funk is a combination of... Anything you want to do. Anything you not, want to do. Not being put in that bag. Here's you know. another question. Um, now, are, do we plan to hear from you as far as a new CD you're going to drop? We got one coming out at the beginning of the year. All right. 2010, everybody. Power yeah. Player Magazine, 2010. We want to be in the audience. You know that. Oh, yeah. We're going to be tearing the roof off tonight. Too. All right. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to accept those tickets now. Okay, see you there. <laughs> All right, everyone, we're live here with George Clinton. We are actually at the Beverly Hills Hotel on Sunset. It's beautiful. And I always want to tear the roof off. And, and he wants to tear the roof off this thing. <laughs> so thank you so much for tuning in. We have Quincy Jones, and we're live with this wonderful man, the Power Player Mag. Thank you so much for your time. So what brings you out this evening? My best friend, Brian Saban, 55 years. I have to keep up with him and show his behavior. So. I'm going to, I'm going to do an album with Tony Bennett and Stevie Wonder, okay. and um, Snoop Dogg and Clark Terry, okay. and nine movies, okay. I'm going to Brazil for the favelas of Katrina, oh, I'm, I'm never going to retire. No. Chocolates in the house. Chocolates in the house. Hey. So how are you doing today? I'm doing very well. I'm overjoyed. 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 So tell us a little bit about your I got my, I got my new, I got my new dumbbell right here. Do my little workout. This is, this is the dumbbell. This is a power <laughs> player moment. Yes. I got my, it's beautiful, beautiful award. It's board. very beautiful. It's wonderful. Yeah, really, really. Yeah, the well, you know, you contributed great. much to the society. We love you. We care about you. I got a question for you. Sure, sure. 
our magazine is called The Power of Player. Mm. And my question to you, if you could talk to us about two influential people that made a powerful impact in your life, besides your, you know, anyone in your family, who mm. would those two people be? And can you share them with our readers and our viewership? Uh, I would say one of the people was Dr. John Henry Clark, who taught me to aspire to be greater than myself, and to seek, to understand, and study, 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 study. The other one was my mom. Uh -huh.